Once upon a time, in a quaint little village nestled amidst rolling hills and lush forests, there lived a young man named Oliver. Oliver was a quiet soul, known for his gentle demeanor and a heart full of kindness that seemed to have no boundaries. He was known throughout the village for his willingness to lend a hand, his soft-spoken wisdom, and his love for nature. One warm, sunny morning, as the birds serenaded the world with their cheerful songs, Oliver decided to take a stroll through the woods. The forest was alive with vibrant colors and the sweet scent of blooming flowers. He marveled at the beauty of it all, feeling like he was walking through a living painting. As Oliver wandered deeper into the woods, he came across something truly remarkable. Hanging from the branch of an old oak tree was a delicate chrysalis, the home of a future butterfly. Its outer shell glistened like a precious jewel, and Oliver was captivated by the intricate patterns on its surface. He sat down beneath the tree and watched with bated breath as the chrysalis began to tremble. The struggle within was intense, as the butterfly-to-be fought to break free from its confining casing. Oliver couldn't help but be moved by this tiny creature's determination to emerge into the world. After what seemed like an eternity, the chrysalis finally split open, and a struggling butterfly began to emerge. Its wings were crumpled and weak, its body fragile. Oliver watched in awe as the butterfly fought to straighten its wings, to gain strength. It was a struggle of survival, a fight for existence. Oliver couldn't bear to see the butterfly suffer, so he carefully reached out and snipped the remaining threads of the chrysalis with his pocket knife. The butterfly tumbled gently into his palm. Its wings, though still a bit crumpled, began to unfold more easily now. But something strange happened. The butterfly, though now free from its cocoon, remained weak and unable to fly. It fluttered clumsily in Oliver's hand, never truly taking flight. He watched, perplexed and saddened, as the butterfly's life slowly ebbed away. In that moment, Oliver realized he had made a grave mistake. The struggle of emerging from the cocoon, while arduous, was essential for the butterfly. It was nature's way of strengthening its wings, of preparing it for the challenges of the world. By intervening and easing the butterfly's struggle, he had unwittingly deprived it of its greatest strength. As he sat there, a profound realization washed over Oliver. He understood that life's struggles, just like the butterfly's struggle to break free from its cocoon, were what made us strong. They were the crucibles that shaped us into resilient, capable beings. With this newfound wisdom, Oliver pledged to embrace his own struggles and challenges, knowing that they were the cocoon that would transform him into a better version of himself. He left the forest that day with a heavy heart, but also with a profound sense of purpose and understanding. From then on, Oliver became an even greater source of inspiration in his village. He shared his story of the butterfly cocoon with everyone he met, reminding them that struggles were not obstacles to be avoided, but stepping stones to success. And in the midst of life's trials, he remained, like the butterfly, a symbol of strength, resilience and the beauty that could emerge from struggle. So, my dear friends, let Oliver's tale serve as a reminder that our struggles are not our enemies, they are our greatest teachers. Just as the butterfly emerged from its cocoon with the strength to soar, so too can we emerge from our challenges with the power to conquer our dreams and achieve greatness. Embrace your struggles, for they are the wings that will lift you to new heights.